Thank you for joining us tonight at 5. I'm Laura Monteverdi. Hello, good evening, everybody. I'm Bob Clawson. It's good to have you with us. A big day in education today in the state of Arkansas. The much talked about and long awaited education reform package revealed cover to cover. The bill filed just minutes ago is long and includes several key parts. Governor Sarah Huckabee Sanders spoke about those when she announced the bill earlier this month. Andrew Epperson joining us now live with the latest on this. Say, hey, Andrew, what'd you find out? Bob, you said just moments ago, and you were right on the money on that when the bill just filed within the last few minutes. I'm looking at it right now on the legislature's website. It's 144 pages, so there'll be plenty to get through uh, over the coming days as we break this down here. There are moments throughout the day where lawmakers thought that the bill would be filed, but ultimately it was just before 5 o'clock, which is when the Senate office closes. So we now have the bill in its entirety, as both of you said. But let's take a look at some of the key points that have already been laid out as we've covered this over the last several weeks. First and foremost, we have a $50,000 minimum teacher salary, which is amongst the highest in the country, a school voucher program that would allow parents to use state money to send their kids to private schools or use that money for homeschooling and also career-ready diplomas for students. It would also repeal the Fair Teacher Dismissal Act, which opponents say puts teachers at risk of being unjustifiably fired. Proponents say reform is the only way to get Arkansas's poor education numbers out of the gutter. If we want to look at making Arkansas a better place to live and work and raise a family, education reform is really the foundation of that. Last I heard, the plan is to run this bill in committee uh, on Wednesday. That's less than 48 hours notice for lawmakers and just all the Arkansans who have some interest in this bill. Uh, so we, you know, certainly think that we, we need more time. I just taken a look through this bill. It's clear that many Republicans have their name attached to this as co-sponsors, both on the House side and the Senate side. With 144 pages, it's clear even those highlights that I just included, there are many more things to get through. So I'm sure in coming days, that'll be a big part of what we're doing here at KARK4 News is taking a look at this bill, figuring out how this is going to impact teachers and students and education in Arkansas in general. We will be the first to update you once we go through it. Live Little Rock, Andrew Epperson, back to you.